Hi guys, welcome to my channel. 365 days with God and Jesus. I have brought God's word into my life. It made me both calm and energized. I wish you to get these powerful feelings too. From the last clip, I share my word of the third week of the year 2022. For those who are just visiting for the first time, I would like to inform about Word. W-O-R-D Word is the tool to explore ourselves. W means words or sentences that hit our heart. O order means what do that words or sentences tell us? Let you speak your way. R reality means situations in our lives that match word and D direction means what we will do next in this clip I'm gonna share about my two words of the fourth week of this year the first comes from Bible diary January the 25th word is Jesus appeared to the eleven and said to them Go into the whole world and proclaim the gospel to every creature. Whoever believes and baptizes will be saved. Whoever does not believe will be condemned. These signs will accompany those who believe in my name. They will drive out demons. They will speak new languages. These sentences tell me that Everything is according to God's will. The reality in my life is I am Thai and the Thai language is my mother tongue. When I was young, I spoke a few simple French and German words such as Shatam, Mercy, Equality. Oh, it feels so cool. When I grow up, I didn't attend the third language anymore and it seemed like the third language was very distant from me but now because of creating this YouTube channel I have to translate English description and scripts to many languages of course I use Google Translate and thank you so much for Google and every time I make a YouTube clip that has many languages. I feel happy and think of the people of each country. I wish them happy, healthy, and found only good things. It's like we are one and we are all human beings. Oh, do I look like Miss Pierce? And my direction is keep doing, yes, and the last comes from Bible Diary, January the 27th. I have two W in this day. The first W is, Who am I, Lord God? And who are the members of my house that you have brought me to this point? Yet even this you see as too little, Lord God. You have also spoken of the house of your servant for a long time to come. These two you have shown to man, Lord God. And the second W is, The measure with which you measure will be measured out to you, and still more will be given to you. To the one who has, more will be given. From the one who has not, even what he has will be taken away. These two W tell me to give. The reality in my life is, today, a woman consulted me about her job and asked about the cost. I told her, and she said it was expensive. She cannot afford it. I got that and asked her job description and gave her advice. She thanked me and told me that she would transfer the money to me. However, she can pay me only 10% of the total fee. I told her to think of it 
as a birthday present and asked her to bring money or snacks that she made to make merit for the elderly. She was happy and promised. I realized that I had come a long way from where I used to be. Some I have more than her, and some she has more than me. Just because I gave her doesn't mean I'm superior to her, and I am willing to contribute my knowledge and skills to the benefit of people. And my direction is: look for what else I can do to help people. Okay. All of these are my word of the fourth week of this year. I really invite you to do your word, and you can share to people in your life, or you can share in the comments below. You can be sure that your sharing is valuable. Thank you for your subscription, and see you in the next clip. Bye bye.